series Negros collected three valuable points against bottom side Bonquet when the two sides met again in Group F faction of the 2018 AFC Cup held at the Phnom Penh Olympic National Stadium. The second meeting between the two teams finished 4-2-0 to the visitors, more than half short of what they accomplished in their first encounter. Series star man Bienvenido Marinon did one better this time, increasing his output against Bonquet from 2 to 3 by garnering a hat trick in Cambodia. His goals were complemented by Takumi Uesido, who notched the game's last goal, a contrast in their first outing where he opened the scoring. The Cambodians were well beaten, 9 to 0. In Bacolod and were simply determined to not just avoid another drubbing but also alter their fortunes against the reigning ASEAN zone champions. Initially, they looked good value to avoid yet another embarrassment as they started the game with the intent of drawing first blood. Yet intentions are only half the part as Julia Soibo and Macon Talichuri registered the first two shots of the game from which they were unable to score with. Well aware of their opponent's might, it's as good as imperative for Bonquet to grab the opening goal. Eventually, the visitors found their footing in mainland Southeast Asia and began to wrest control of the game. While Bonquet remained threatening, series gradually created chances largely thanks to the efforts of Pat Rukreigelt, Stefan Schrock, and Marinon. They nearly opened the scoring within 23 minutes only for Reichelt to be denied by the post. It looked as if Bonquet would be able to emerge into halftime still level with the busmen but the Filipinos had other ideas. Marinon got on the end of two well-worked goals in the space of two first half minutes to suddenly put the busman away from sight. Eight minutes before halftime, he finished a chance created by Schrock by guiding the ball into the bottom corner with his left foot. The next minute, the Spanish forward was set up by Reichelt inside the box before using his right foot to strike his second goal of the night. The floodgates looked to have opened at that point. Luckily for the hosts, the scores only remained at 2-2-0 come halftime. More relaxed after taking a comfortable two-goal lead, Series continued to control the flow of the match. The result looked certain and it was a matter of how many more the visitors came back past the outclassed home side. Marinon capped off his hat trick with a sublime finish in front of goal. He had OJ Porteria to Thabk this time around as the winger drew the defense's attention before setting up the forward from Cadiz, Spain. The goal scoring did not stop there as Uesito joined the party late in the match. Coming on as a substitute, the former JPV Marikina striker buried one past Suyeti who ended the night with an unenviable record of conceding 13 goals against the busman. Only a win by Home United has kept Series from advancing into the next round as Group F winners. The Singaporean side's important win against Sean United meant that they could still overtake Series with a win in Bacolod. Nevertheless, even a loss by series could take them through as the best runner-up in the three ASEAN groups provided they don't lose heavily at home and hope that not both Persija and Song Lanhun could win by margins huge enough to supersede series goal difference in their last group stage assignments. While all of that happening is quite unlikely, nothing is ever impossible in a span of 90 minutes of football. The two teams will battle for Group F supremacy at the Pinot Stadium in Bacolod on the 25th of April. On the same day, the no-bearing duel between Sean United and Bolonghead will also take place in Myanmar. Advertisements <laughs>